This work presents a motion capture driven locomotion controller for quadrupedal robots that replicates the non periodic footsteps and subtle body movement of animal motions. Legged animals continue to inspire roboticists with their elegant motions. Even in slow paced walking modes, animal motions are distinctively smooth and graceful. Unfortunately, we have very limited understanding of the underlying patterns and principles of animal motions. Hence, reproducing such organic movements on legged robots comes with great challenges. This work explores the challenge of making the motions generated by robots appearing more animal-like. Our approach leverages pre-recorded motion capture data collected from quadrupedal animals. We transfer position trajectories of animal joints to robots with different shapes and morphologies. We refer to this approach as motion capture driven locomotion control. The main challenge of the motion capture driven locomotion control is to bridge the gap in morphology between animals and robots. It requires a remapping procedure named motion retargeting to ensure that the resulting target motions are feasible on a robot. In this work, we transfer high-level information about target animal motion, namely football timings and a body movement profile. From a target animal motion data, we collect the trajectories of forward sideways and the turning speed signals, as well as a parts of body pose we want to reproduce. We multiply each quantity by a hand-tuned scaling factor that addresses the dimensional and morphological discrepancy between the robot and the animal. Then we extract a sequence of contact and the swing phase timings for each animal limb. Finally, we distill this information into a reference-based trajectory and footholds that is subsequently tracked by a model-based motion controller. This simple motion retargeting strategy enables easy adaption to different robot platforms. With the motion capture data sets collected from various legged animals. A retargeted animal motion inherits the agile and non periodic nature of animal movements. To produce such a motion on a robot, our control pipeline requires a motion controller that robustly tracks retargeted animal motions. We use the combination of a model predictive control and a whole body control methods for our motion controller. At the core of our motion controller, we employ a noble nonlinear MPC formulation that generates dynamically coherent base trajectories and footholds. Our nonlinear model predictive controller uses the variable height inverted pendulum model that represents a legged robot as a point mass concentrated at the system's center of mass. Given reference based trajectory and footholds, we formulate the finite horizon optimal control problem that minimizes the discrepancy between references and dynamics aware trajectory and footholds subject to variable height inverted pendulum model dynamics. By finding optimal solution, we generate refined base trajectories and the footholds. To achieve real-time performance, we use a sparse Gaussian Newton solver for sensitivity analysis that allows us to efficiently find a local minimizer of the nonlinear program. The nonlinear variable height inverted pendulum model correctly handles flight phases. This capability is crucial for replicating retargeted animal motions as animal motions are commonly associated with frequent flying phases and significant up and down body movements. The foothold optimization significantly improves the robustness of the system. As this video shows, it effectively prevents undesirable leg like crossing or stretching configurations. Meanwhile, our prior mocap based locomotion control method relies on Raybert's heuristic as two aggressive displacements for the feet.
Furthermore, the foot hold optimization improves the ability of the motion controller to reject unexpected disturbances. We verified the effectiveness of our control pipeline in a series of simulation and hardware experiments with the Quadrupedal Robots Unit 3A1. We used the data collected in-house from a ship trained to walk and a trot on a treadmill. Additionally, we used the publicly available motion data recorded from a dog. In our experiments, our method effectively recreated unstructured stepping patterns and natural body movements of animals with different morphologies and dimensions. In our experiments, we used the variable height inverted pendulum model as a simplified template for a robot. However, our nonlinear MPC formulation is applicable to different dynamics models for quadrupedal locomotion. As a future investigation, we are interested in combining our method with more complex dynamics models such as the single rigid body model and augmenting them with the same foothold optimization described in this work. Furthermore, we intend to make our motion controller responsive to a user's high-level commands by integrating a gait planning strategy that imitates animal gait patterns. Thank you very much for listening.